A mammoth find, four in your corner, giving you an exclusive look at an ancient discovery in Cape Coral. Utilities workers finding a mammoth fossil. Archaeologists say this could be tens of thousands of years old. Four in your corner's Tony Sidiku has more on how this fossil is giving archaeologists a window into our distant past. A local utilities crew knew they had something special when they found this in a trench 17 feet below the ground. The crew was digging off of Southwest 19th Avenue in Cape Coral back in July. And as it turns out, what they found wasn't just a rock. Archaeologists say it's a fossil and probably one belonging to a woolly mammoth or mastodon. Never in my wildest dreams that I will be so close to a, a portion of what used to be a mammoth or a mastodon. It's exciting for Mercedes Zambrano with the City of Cape Coral Public Works, especially since there are only two known mammoth fossil sites in Lee County. The crew turned over the fossil to the city, which brought in archaeologists to assess. Because it was covered in dirt, and the archaeologists, they, they clean it up, and, um, but it is pretty cool. The fossil, nothing to scoff at either. Look how it compares to the size of a AA battery in an iPhone 6. Robert Carr with the Archaeological and Historical Conservancy says the fossil fragment was probably part of the mammoth's humerus bone or upper arm. He estimates the fossil dates back to before humans ever settled here. So we know it's at least 12,500 years old, but it could even be as old as 250,000 years old. Uh, based on similar discoveries. The report says during that time, glacial retreat led to the formation of savannas across Florida and herds of mammoth, bison, antelope, and horse roam the peninsula. So while you might not find a fossil of an extinct mammal digging through your backyard tonight, Carl believes plenty more archaeological wonders lie deep underground. If you excavate enough places in Florida, you'll find that these fossil beds are uh, prevalent. Tony Sudiku, Fox 4, in your corner. Tony says the city of Cape Coral plans to donate the fossil to the Cape Coral Historical Museum where you and your family can see it up close. Officials say that process, that handoff, should be finished within the next couple of months.